Reality Radio, the first virtual edition. Right. We're, we're on computer screens, yeah? <laughs> Because it was recommended to me that we shouldn't hang out because we could uh we could pass the Rona on to each other. Yeah, we could. And I don't want to do that. I want to introduce you guys to my my puppy though, Samantha. Hey, you know what's crazy, bro? I had a cat named Samantha. Did you? I swear. That's a real odd name. I had a friend named Samantha. What happened? Was... Did you guys like fall out or something? Yeah. Who, your cat? It was a long time ago. <laughs> yeah, you did. It was a long time ago. I did have a bird named Alani, actually. A word? Mm-hmm. A yeah, what? it was really nice. All right, so I feel like a lot... I say this every time, but I do feel like a lot has definitely happened since right. the last time we met up. Right. Tessie? Yeah. <laughs> I'm still looking where at you. Been? <laughs> because where have you been, Tessie? <laughs> uh, where have you been for like a month? <laughs> Stop thinking. <laughs> it was about a month. It, it, nah, it was like two weeks. <laughs> Are you serious? Two, yeah, it was two weeks. I swear, no, it really felt like you were gone for a month. Like, you did a month worth of activities, for I did, sure. I did. <laughs> Ellen, do you have all screens on right now? Are you not seeing this? <laughs> I'm trying to figure out how this thing <laughs> works. Oh, now I just see you. <sighs> all right, there we go. Do all screens. Because I don't know if you heard the little farting noise that was happening, but that was real. Yo, if I mess up this up, she's going to kill me. Ah! Oh, we lost Ellen. Damn. Oh, no. Ellie. Oh, no. <laughs> Way to start the podcast off, Ellen. Listen, <laughs> this is all new to me, okay? Me I'm not, well, I'm used to doing like FaceTime and all that stuff, Don't but not here. Zoom. Like, hey, bear with me. Zoom is Zoom is it. Zoom is it. I was telling uh I was telling you guys and Reed yesterday that um Hi Natalie. I don't even know how to put it Hi Natalie. Hi. Oh, we have a special guest already. Yeah, we got a special guest, Natalie in the house. What the heck? Hey. 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 It's you ain't got no energy, bro. <laughs> you're making me you're making us look bad, man. You gotta turn up. <laughs> you gotta turn up. Next time, next time, Natalie. Natalie has her own uh, custom uh, Big Reed coaster. Ooh, that's wet. Oh, that's hot. That's nice. She got she got Big Reed stickers too. Nice. Yeah. I want a Big Reed coaster. Right, me too. No. I'm just saying. I, I had I to get her. Bad. I had to get her a bunch of Big Reed stuff because she kept walking around with a DJ Tussie flyer for a long time. So you know. But that's not fair. She thought I was DJ Khaled. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even tell you how many times I went to a high school in the last year and a half that people were like, DJ Khaled. I'm like, you bastards. You bastards. Um, all right, Ellen, back to what we were talking about. Yeah, sorry. Um, I was in Mexico. It was only oh, it was only two weeks. It felt like a month, but it was only two weeks. And uh, I went out there. My boy, DJ Billy Knight, uh, you know, you guys know him. He would always come to KCR. Definitely. An artist. Yay. He hit me on like a Sunday and was like, bro, come to Mexico. And I was like, when? I, and I literally just dropped my daughter off at her mom's. And uh, he was like, come to Mexico. I was like, all right, when? He's like, tomorrow. He's like, tonight, tomorrow. I was like. He's like, right now. Yeah, I was like, all right, bet. So Sunday, he told me this and I was on a plane Monday. Um, I flew to San Diego. Our, our homie, Macker Otis. She doesn't go by that name anymore, by the yeah, way. Macaroni. Young macaroni. She ordered she macaroni at Black Bear. Oh, you saw Bread. her? Yeah, she picked me up from uh, the airport and drove me to the border, and I just walked over. Oh, snap. I didn't know that. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, you know that now. That's why I'm telling you all about it, right? No, but usually, you know, you post about it on, like, Instagram, or you show, you know. Oh, yeah, yeah. She came. She picked me up looking like the Taliban. She was all... <laughs> she's like, don't touch me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure she Lysol'd her front seat and and took the wipes to it when I got out. Oh, let me tell you, she's DM me a, a bunch of different links over the past couple of weeks. She is fully invested into this coronavirus yeah, thing for sure. But over is she the- like invested as far as like you know conspiracy theory invested or 
trying to like save the game. because like right now there's like a division there's both you have like people that are just like full-on conspiracy theory like you know this is all 5g and you know it was planned it was so and so it's a uh, whatever and then you have people that are just like fully like tripping about trying to stay safe and and clean and not getting sick right so what was she she's both <laughs> No, like for real. She's like, oh, like oh. <laughs> she, was, she was like, there's 30,000 people that just died from this. I was like, okay. It's like, I get it. Like, oh. But then she's like, you know, talking about all the conspiracy too. Right. No, it's, it's pretty, it's pretty weird though. Cause like when you left though, it was bad, but it wasn't where we're at now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Put it in your mouth. <laughs> I just got the craziest text messages. I'm so sorry, but I hear you. <laughs> oh, Pacino. What you eat here, Ellen? What we what what do we crunch on during our podcast? Please let us know. It's like it's like it's like no matter what, she's gonna be eating something. Belvita. Belvita. Oh, okay. Making hella noises on the sides. Those are good. Oh, is it making a lot of noise? My bad. Yeah, fool. We can hear everything. <sighs> <laughs> now nah, but uh mexico is dope because literally when i got in monday i got a text message from you ellen saying mm -hmm. that, uh papas and beers was closed and that was the spot that we were gonna go dj and um i like i i swear i walked right over the border and then i got your text message with the screenshot like your message was the first message i received in, in did i break the news to you yeah you did I was like, what? I was like, please don't tell me you left already because they freaking canceled everything. <laughs> Reed, what the fuck is going Reed? on? Reed? <laughs> Reed looks like a scary movie. Like a face is about to pop up. <laughs> like, hello. There he is, of course. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's kind of lit. <laughs> Damn. What kind of curtain? Um, your daughter what kind of curtains do you dark. have? Um, right. Yeah, I'm this, just this, saying, because that's pretty, pretty black clutch, right? That's black and curtains. Mm hmm. There he is. Oh, kitty calendars. Oh. Oh, the kitty calendar. <laughs> Where'd he go um, now? But, Anyways. Uh, I got to. I know. I, but you know what? Go. You had the best response to it, though. You're like, well, I'm on vacation. I yeah. was like, I was like, well, I guess I'm on vacation then. Mm -hmm. so, but we uh we had fun. We uh, I DJed a spot. I DJed like maybe four or five different places. Uh, but they were just Club like, Corona. Yeah, Club Corona. This mother, this dude was in the mix at Club <laughs> Corona while we're all sheltering. Oh, in right. place. You're hiding from the coronavirus. Yeah, he's at Club Corona. DJing at the club. Corona. Yeah. Watching people get spun around their shoulders like they're gonna get a, a suplex. Right, that dude. That was dope. Right. I want him to do that to me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to laugh. <laughs> I want to see that. That was hella funny. Um, I wish I had. I wish we could share the content. Oh, maybe I could. Nah, I deleted it off my phone. Oh well. Mm. But uh, oh, did I I pet a tiger, and when I did, Hold when I did, bro, I like the tiger uh, pick, uh, bro, everybody was like. Have you seen Tiger King? This is the same time that just came out. So Tiger King drops on Netflix. Tessie posted a picture holding the baby tiger. Yeah. Outside the Club Corona <laughs> in Mexico during a pandemic. Right. And Ellen wants to turn up the volume while I'm 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 giving the nice little thing that we could use on Instagram. Right. Thanks, Ellen. I'm trying to plug my phone up because I don't want it to die. Wow. Way to prepare, Ellen. Way to prepare. <laughs> well, I'm preparing now. Right. No, nah, it's cool. I'm preparing now. Um, no. I shit. What else I do? Oh, look, her phone died the whole the whole time she was doing. Oh, there we go. <laughs> oh, so you're gonna start talking shit, huh, Tessie? Start talking shit, hell of shit. <laughs> you thought I was off? Okay, I see how it is. Um, let's see. I rode I see ATVs. How quick the is. Rode ATVs. Uh. Well, let's see, shit, eight. eight What's this about two. you falling? Oh, yeah. So I was I was on the ATV, and I was just wilding out, you know what I mean? And I was riding on the edge of, like, these little cliffs. 
So in Mexico, they got these sand dunes that you can ride ATVs in, and there's no, like, you don't have to wear helmets. You don't have to do anything. There's no safety precautions. They don't even warn you that there's cliffs that you can, like, lose your entire vehicle off of, roll over, and die from. So Sounds like I, Mexico. Right. I was riding the cliffs, and then I was riding the edges, and then my, my ATV just kind of went over the edge, and I, I looked down, and I saw a cliff. And then I saw, oh, snap. I saw two dead dolphins and I saw a bunch of rocks. So my ATV just went over. I jumped off this way. And hey, that's kind of dope. It went this way. I jumped that way. And then my ATV just rolled down the hill. I got, I had to pay like $50 because I broke it. You know, people die like that. Yeah, I know people die like you that. You got to be careful with shit like that. I hurt my shin and my, my right ass cheek. Okay. Reed, what toy do you have now? I feel like Reed has like all these toys that he's just so excited to show us. I don't think I have a toy. I, bas I basically hit the button on accident and I was like, how do you turn this off? So I was trying to turn it off. I thought you had to like run through, like pick it up and everything. But damn, bro, I'm happy you didn't die. Yeah, yeah. You know, like that would have been tragic. That's a that's a peaceful, like they say that that sound right there cleanses out the mind. All right, let's cleanse the mind real quick. Can you guys hear this? I can hear it now. Home. <laughs> Taking a quick second to meditate and to clear our mind before. We get into the real topics of oh, reality okay. radio. Because my, my trip to Mexico wasn't shit, right? All right. <laughs> <laughs> that was just, you know, that was just some light work real quick. <laughs> Before we get into the podcast. There you go. That's my singing bowl. That was nice. I like that. I want to get one. Do you feel relaxed, Reed? Reed? Tiger King. Tiger King over what? here? I'm good. Oh, Joe Exotic. <laughs> Read Exotic. Read Exotic. Give me a patch here. Right? Who's the only one like that? <laughs> hey, what the fuck? That's creepy. It's not creepy. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that's weird, bro. This kid get everything she Dude, wants. giving us access to Zoom is the equivalent of Flavor Flav having a TikTok. Oh, shit. That was many. Just saying. Flavor Flav. Flavor. You know, you got kicked out of the phone. All right, so while I was in Mexico, Ellen, what were you doing? Well, you were in Mexico. Well, let's see. Um, I know I've talked about it many a times that I work at a hotel as well. And, well, that hotel completely closed down. So they let everybody go until all this is over because, obviously, business is not good with the travel ban. Mm. So I've been sleeping. That's big to me. Like, to yeah. me, that's big because you guys know I don't sleep, like, at all. Like, I would be up all night working. What you call it, and then go to the radio station after Monday through Friday. So I've been sleeping, and then um, just this past week for uh, the radio station, I've had to work from home. So I've been working from home, and for fun, I've been learning how to play the ukulele. Oh, nice! So that's good. And I've been working out and um, just cleaning and organizing. I feel like that's what everybody is really doing, right? No? Yeah. Just kind of getting your like stuff together. I'm really trying to open this up. Just no, kind of I'm, getting I'm, your I'm, stuff I'm together. Like, I don't know. I feel like this does give you time to kind of like get your ducks in a row to really like stop and like organize and, you know, clean up your life and clean up your home. So that's what I've been doing. Reading too. I don't know how to play. I learned how to play the ukulele, but I don't. Mm. Can you play? I won't grab my ukulele. Go ahead. Play. I don't know how to play anything really yet. So far, all I know is row, row, row your boat. Natalie. 